This is a cup, and this is a board. Put on the board, and have a cupboard. Oh, don't leave me, don't leave me. <laughs> hey, what's up guys, and welcome back to today's video. Uh, today I wanted to do an unboxing of the newer condenser microphone that I purchased for my smartphone and DSLR. Um, I currently don't have my DSLR with me, uh, but I wanted to buy this mic and try it out for that DSLR to see how it works. Um, I was hoping to use a obligatory uh, big ass knife for all you uh, Techno Buffalo fans from back in the day to unbox this, but uh, unfortunately, there's nothing to cut. So let's go ahead and get into the unboxing. Uh, so this is the box itself. Uh, pretty simple, no tape, nothing really to cut open. Let's go ahead and see what's inside. All right, so opening it up, looks like we have some instruction manuals. Cool, seems pretty basic, pretty simple. We have our uh, additional um, information. Oh, this is the actual instruction manual. Uh, the other one looks like it is a warranty card, so that's cool. Not sure what this is. Let's go ahead and set it aside for now. We have a nice uh, silica gel packet here. Uh, dangerous, do not eat. Good to know. I will not be doing that. Also in the box, we have a microphone. Let's see, it looks like a microphone to a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack so that's cool this one is um, corded so that's pretty nice uh, the other cable here looks to be the same cable except a straight cable so that's nice that they included two uh, the other thing in the box is a microphone mount looks like there is a area to mount this onto either camera mount or on top of your DSLR so that's pretty neat to have. Newer branding there. And the last item in the box, oh, we have two. So we have our foam microphone here. Looks to be a little deformed, but I'm sure once you leave it out, it'll sort of regain its shape. Let's go ahead and put that off to the side so we can take a look at our main attraction. So this is the condenser mic. This is the newer CM14 model. As you can see, it's pretty tiny, about the size of a chapstick or a lipstick. So nothing too crazy in terms of size. Let's go ahead and put this foam mic on top and then attach it to the, ooh, it's taking some resistance to get on there. That's what she said. All right, so that's pretty nice. Hopefully it regains its shape. And then this is the mount here. Let's go ahead and pop this on, just like that. Pretty clean setup. There was one more thing in the box that I didn't touch on, and this is the, looks like it's a windscreen for the microphone. Let's go ahead and open this up and see how it looks like. <laughs> wow. This, uh... Guys, we have a dead mouse. <laughs> Oh man, this do you see this thing? It it looks like the thing from the Adams family. That is hilarious. Alright. This thing looks like it has pretty glorious flowing hair, which uh it's actually coming off. As you can see, not sure if you can see in the video, but let's go ahead and transplant some of this and put it on my hair. It's uh it's a lot bigger than than what I thought. I, I saw a picture of this on the product uh, description, but I did not realize that it was gonna be this big. Let's uh, hold up the microphone for size and look at that. So it looks like there's a small insert at the very bottom where you insert the head of the mic in. Let's see if we can find the hole there. <laughs> God. Why do I have so many that's what she said jokes on this video? Oh man. All right, so it looks like the hole is right there. Let's go ahead and take this off the mount and pull off the foam and see if we can stick this on. No, oh, there is some resistance. 
Let's go ahead and get it in. And, uh, oh yeah, look at that. Let me break out the, uh, the Gatsby hair wax. So this is it. I wanna go ahead and plug this up to the mic and we'll go ahead and do a quick audio comparison of how it sounds like. I'm currently recording on my lapel mic and it's been working okay up to this point, but I'm genuinely curious if this mic will perform better. All right, I will be back. Hey, what's up guys? And I am back. This time I am recording using the condenser mic and I am about to clean this shit up from my board. <laughs> I don't know if you can see this. Literally, it was like a remnant of hairball. Um, so yeah, hopefully that sounds good. Let's get our little pet rock in the center there and our uh, dead mouse next to him. So this is again the audio recording using the new, newer CM14 condenser mic. All right guys, this has been a quick unboxing of the newer CM14 condenser mic and a quick sound clip uh, using the mic itself. This is the, shit, it's not standing up. This is the CM14 mic with the dead mouse in the cup and our little pet rock making F3 faces to the mic. Thanks for watching and take care and have a great day.